Almeric Osman, who scored a hat-trick against Bermuda, has found himself going to Djibouti City from Port Djibouti, who are fierce rivals. And he's gone on a free. That's huge. That's a great move. Djibouti City must be very pleased. Djibouti won't even have to be at their best to see off Brunei. No contest. Continue. Uh, oh no, you've got to be kidding me. Brunei are not even playing Nuren's Box. We're going to have to change this around a bit. I mean, that kind of makes sense. Nuren's Box can't even make it into the Brunei first team. I wish he was playing. But then again, it wouldn't be as good if he was playing from the start. That Oh dear. Oh, it could have been 1-0 so quickly. Come on, Djibouti. Let's go. Strike them quick. No. 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 Thank you, Orens. It would be really embarrassing. Especially with Nurin in attendance. Hussein. Osman. Control. Find that pass. Knox Milford. Yes. Lebauma. Come on. Oh, that was a quality strike. And nearly found the bottom corner. Alright. It's looking promising by Djibouti. I want to see goals. Ugwe, Yassin, Osman. There's Hussein. Yeah! And the new Djibouti City signing. Almeric Osman has made it 1-0 to Djibouti inside the first 10 minutes. And you see that forward that has been chosen by our new assistant manager did more in them 10 minutes than the other guy, who I can't even remember the name of, did in... Oh, he scored. Wow. I mean, that other striker had about five games to make a name for himself, and he didn't score. He didn't assist. This guy, within 20 minutes, made an assist. That's a lovely goal as well. This is the kind of player that we want up front for Djibouti. Labalma. Lovely. Cabs, it's three. They made subs, but I don't think Niren's Box has made the move. I can't believe it, they're not going to bring in Niren's box, but then again the formation shows that they're not playing attacking midfielders. Oh, yes, Niren's box is on! we got 30 minutes with Niren's box! This is it! This is the crossover everybody wanted, Milford, Osman. And as soon as Niren's box comes onto the field, it's Djibouti on the attack. Djibouti want a fourth, but we also want to see Nerens Box score a dramatic goal. He's he's made five passes, well done, mate, and completed four of them. Lobalma, all right, come on, power your way through. Yes, smash it. Oh, oh, Eddie Rose is gonna get sent off. Brunei have a slight way into this game. Oh, it's a race. Here we go, Brunei! Arentz is saying no. Brunei want to get that goal. Oh, yes. Arentz, oh, man! Arentz is just killing it right now. It's going to be Djibouti 3, Brunei 0. Nuren's box had 30 minutes and we didn't even see his name. It could not have gone any better. Firstly, he doesn't even make the first team. And secondly, when he does, he's got 30 minutes to prove himself and he doesn't do anything. Oh, a, a terrible foul there. Yellow card. Brian Kaltak. We've took it early. Lobalma into cabs. Udo. Perfect. Goal. Just wonderful. Almeric Osman has scored again. Come on, cabs. Run. Yes. Hussein holds it up. Not in the box himself. He's doing the dirty work for Djibouti. I think it was Milford who hit the crossbar there. Oh, oh, it's 2-0. Eric Hussein doing the business. That's what we like to see from a striker. If that other kid did it, we wouldn't have had a problem. Oh, Vanuatu, have that. All right, Vanuatu have done more than the Nuren's box. Dominique Fred. Do Dominique Fred. Dominique Fred. Oh, Gashleg. Oh, no. No one else can have a gash leg, mate. Only gash leg can have the gash leg. In other news, Bolivia are losing 3-0 to Argentina. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Vanuatu are drawing against Djibouti. I'm amazed how, like, quickly they've got back into this game. They looked dead and buried at one point, but Vanuatu are in the ascendancy. Can we find a dramatic winner? Or a Vanuatu gonna spoil it for us? Dominique Fred. Oh, no. 
Vanuatu 3, Djibouti 2. Level it up. Milford, come on. Hassan, deliver. Yeah, Gilbert, all right, come on. Going to have to take this 3 all draw because Vanuatu, after our second goal, just looked like a completely different beast. This is the free agent draft from 2020. Whole Hole Royals come out on top here. They've got four players from this. It took them four years, but eventually they got that act together. We've also got Day Forest picking up three, Bissadero United picking up two, Balho and Darley. You know, the list goes on. This is the, a big list of players here. Kader Hassan, who started out playing on the wing for the national team, has taken the managerial job of Port Djibouti. I mean, he's pretty terrible. Let's be honest here. He's not great. There's better managers around. It would be lovely to have him in the setup, but I've got to think about quality instead of the name. Deco just decides to drop out of assistant management in Ali Sabio, just applying to see if he wants to get it. Oh, he's declined it. Under 20 years old, he don't want it. We're in real danger of not qualifying. We've been poor so far and everyone must up their performance levels. Everybody's just like, well, I mean, what do you expect? Assistant manager is getting praise for having faith in the youth. I don't look at age, I look at ability, and these lads have it all. So, it's back to African Cup of Nations qualification, Togo against Djibouti. I might as well put the chat on. I mean, let's just sit back, get smashed by Togo and move on. Can I just say we brought in a 160 potential ability player, more than a year back, and he's still not made the move into the first team of the Djibouti setup. Now, I don't know what's going on there, but clearly he's not cutting it at a club level. Could it be a, a consolation? Yes, it can. Cabs blasts it home. Goal, goal. Let's find another. Yes! Gilbert makes it 3-2. And all of a sudden, Djibouti have a chance in a match that I completely was ignoring. Full time, Togo 4, Djibouti 2. Positives, we did score twice. Negatives... We still lost badly. Djibouti's 20-year-old Burhan Udo is the toast of the nation after breaking the Djiboutian appearance record. He earned his 28th international cap in the recent African Cup of Nations qualifying Group F match against Togo and received acclaim from far and wide for such an outstanding achievement. Goal Goal's previous international record of 27 caps for his country was considered extremely hard to surpass. Really? Djibouti against Guinea-Bissau. We're still going to be outsiders for this game, but Guinea-Bissau are the second worst team in the group, so it's our only hope of getting points in the group stage, especially because it's the home match. Come on, Djibouti. This one means a lot. Goal, goal. Come on. Yes! That's Eddie Rose, isn't it? Eddie Rose with his first goal for Djibouti. He's been a long-standing player in the international setup. There he is with a towering header. And it just creeps past the line. Back in it. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. That was like a catalogue of shit. Udo. Go! Oh, Milford. Oh, you've got to put that across. You can't be going for the shot there. That's it. Game over. Are you going to make it worse? Okay. Our best shot at three points gets slaughtered 4 1. That sounds right. Knox, knocks. Who's there? Milford. Milford, who? Don't know. Seems he's in my back pocket. Djibouti have dropped seven places to 163rd. Could have been worse. Well, the lad with 160 potential ability helped Gobeto Town move into the Premier Division. He's got an average rating of 6.8, one goal, one assist out of seven appearances this season. Is this now the time that he gets picked up by the national team? Uh, nope. Not been chosen. I don't think it's going to be long, but it's very interesting. Jackson Saeed is back. Yes! Wow. Whoa, he dropped Labauma. Fuck me. i got to be honest, guys. We all know what's going to happen here. So, what I'm thinking. I get the team all set up, get the game up and running, and I go for a poo. Literally, that will be more entertaining than watching me lose get smashed by Nigeria. 4-0? Four, four I mean, go down with some dignity, lads. 
Nothing like putting the nail in the coffin with a Decanio volley. No, it's fine, lads. It's, it was only 5-0 beforehand, but you needed to do that. Go! Consolation! Yeah, Jackson's a hit! Jackson's a hit has gone! He come back! Yeah. Yes! Yeah! No! Yes! Oh, goal, goal. It's kind of it. Finish 7-1 to Nigeria. Uh, okay.